Welcome back to this video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you on how to create stocking hair with Saku border in Camtasia video editing software. So let's begin. But before we dive into the tutorial, if you find this tutorial useful and you are following it to this channel, remember to click on that subscribe, turn on the notification bell for more tutorial tips and tricks on how best you can use Camtasia video editing software. So with that being said, let's get started. Welcome back, friends, to my Camtasia video editing workflow right here in my timeline i have two clip right here one clip is screen record the second clip is my talking head so i'm going to work with talking head and see how we can actually create a circle and hard border around it in Camtasia. so the very first thing you need to do is to make sure you go to your tools bar from the sidebar right here make sure you navigate to annotation then the next thing you want to do here is to make sure you navigate to shapes then from shapes, then you have to come here, make sure you select both. Then next thing you need to do is to navigate to this yellow right here. What you want to do here is to double click on it. Then it's going to automatically, so it's going to automatically insert to the timeline. Next thing you need to do is to expand the shape from the beginning to the last of the video clip. Okay. Another thing you can do here is to work on the circle property so you have to come to the sidebar right here so navigate to video section so under the video section we can scale the circle this is depends on how best and how big we want our circle to be the next thing we want to do here is to position the circle i'm going to position the circle right down here okay next thing i want to do here is to reduce the size so i'm going to make it about 180 and press enter key on my keyboard then just like so I'm satisfied with this particular size of the circle. All right, so the next thing we want to do here is to come to the timeline right here, circle timeline right here. What you need to do is to right click on this eye icon and this is going to pump up. Next thing you want to do here is to click on how far. Having click on how far, then the video, main video is going to disappear. Next thing you need to do is to select on the video clip in the timeline then having select the video clip in the timeline, then you can come to the scale. So you can scale the video down a little bit. Then what I need to do here is to simply bring out the video into the circle, just like so. Then right here, I can simply adjust the size to something like 55 and press enter key on my keyboard. Then right here, I will just adjust the talking head based on how best I want it to be. I'm going to still reduce the size to something like, let's see, 50, enter key on my keyboard. Then I'm going to be adjust it more and more. So I'm going to use my arrow key to tap it to the top, left and right, just like so. Now we want to add border to this particular shape. What we need to do is to go back to the timeline right here. Okay, what we need to do next is to press Control D on our keyboard. Then having press Ctrl D on our keyboard, this is going to pop up and it's going to overlay the video. What we need to do is to work on the circle from the timeline. So we have to go to the property from the sidebar right here. We navigate to automation property. Then we have to make sure we turn down the opacity. So having turned down the opacity, we have to come to the color outline right here. We can choose whatever color of our choice. So in this tutorial, I'm going to use red color. Okay, next thing we want to do here is to increase the thickness. So the more you increase the thickness, the more the border is going to appear on your video. If you are satisfied with the result you have right here, so you are good to go. Lastly, I'm going to go back to the main videos in the timeline, then I'm going to increase the size of the main video. So I have to come to the scale right here, then I will just put it in 143 and I press enter key on my keyboard, just like so. Then I'll come here and make sure I fit everything in. So just like so, we have the main video and then we also have the talking head just like so. As you can see right here, so you can begin to play your video and the talking head will also be also uh, will also be played in the background of the video just like so. So I'm going to bring down the talking head a little bit and. Uh, just like so. So you can adjust it based on what exactly you really want to achieve. So I'm going to come back to the video, main video right here. I will make it 145 and press enter key on my keyboard. I just want everything 
to fold the canvas of the video just like so so i'm satisfied with everything right here so basically this is how to simply create circle talking egg in Camtasia video editing software i hope you really got value for this video if you find this video useful give this video a big like and also remember to subscribe to the channel turn on the notification bell for more tutorial tips and tricks on how best you can use Camtasia video editing software thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you in my next video peace